Hey guys, TechieKHD here again with another video, and today I actually have a tutorial for you guys. Now I realize I haven't really made a tutorial in a really long time, even though my channel does promote the creation of tutorials. Uh, now this time I'm going to be showing you guys how to download um, restricted images off of Flickr to your desktop. Uh, now when I say restricted images, I'm not talking about anything uh, illegal or anything um, particularly dangerous or anything of the sort. What I'm talking about is when you find this really awesome photograph on Flickr and you really want to download it, but the user has stopped the downloading of those images. Now it's really really annoying to me personally. I um, I feel like images should definitely be shared across the web. Now, the particular person that I'm going to be downloading images from actually shares them on his Facebook group. Uh, and of course, I download them from there. But of course, they're not the highest quality simply because uh, it's on Facebook. And Facebook has this horrible uh, compression. Um, so what I'm going to do here is I'm, I'm here on Flickr.com. So I'm just going to type in the name. Uh, and here we go. The car hotel photography is what I am going to be downloading from. So I'm just going to come over here and look for an image in particular that I want to download. The reason I love this uh, this photographer here uh, is because he photographs in Dubai, and that of course is my hometown. I love seeing all the new cars that are popping up there all over, uh, all throughout the year. And of course, I am a massive, massive car fan. Uh, honestly, besides for technology, I could do this all day. And I'm thinking of actually starting a car channel now that I have my license. Uh, or that I'm going to be getting my license old enough to have one. Um, so let's see here. Uh, there's a bunch of different images, but of course uh, I'm going to go for uh, the Empire Edition Bugatti Veyron 16.4. Uh, okay, so normally you would come over here to the download section and you would have an, an option download. But of course over here it says the owner has disabled downloading of their photographs. Now, since you do want the highest quality version available, what you're going to do is click on large, which does give you the highest resolution of this photograph available. Of course, you guys can see here, this is definitely the highest uh, resolution version available. Now, of course, you do also need to be using Google Chrome for this. I have tried it out on Safari and it does not work. I feel like it's probably going to work on uh, Firefox as well, but I haven't tried it, so don't quote me on that. Regardless, what you're going to do is right click on the image and click inspect element. Then you're going to be presented with this area right here. Now it's a little bit complicated, it looks a little bit intimidating, but fear not, it actually isn't. What you're going to do is hit Command F if you're on a Macintosh or if you're on a Windows PC. You're going to hit Control F and you're going to type in .jpg. Uh, of course, that is the file extension for JPEG. Now it's going to say one of two right here, or it could say one of a couple. What you're going to do is click on the link that it shows you and hit open a new tab. And of course, the first one over here was a really tiny resolution. So what you're going to do is hit this little arrow to go down, and it's going to bring you to the second version. Now, of course, when you hover over it, it is actually going to show you the resolution. So what you can do is right click on the link and hit open a new tab. Now here, of course, is the high resolution image of the 16.4 edition Mansori uh, Bugatti Veyron. This is the Empire edition. So of course, over here, uh, regardless, this is the full size, full resolution image, uh, as opposed to the page over here where it was actually part of a web page. The photograph is actually stored on Flickr and you can actually download it. So this image right here, what you can do is hit right click, save image as, and of course, rename it to whatever you want. I'm just going to rename that to Empire uh, Bugatti, uh, choose the location and hit save. Uh, when I head over to my desktop, as you guys can see here, this is the full resolution photo, super crisp, super clear, you can see the weave on the carbon fiber, but regardless, that is basically how it's done. So anyway guys, thank you so much for watching this video, if it helped you out, please do remember to leave a like rating and to share this video with your friends if they were wondering how to do this. And for more videos like these, as well as other unboxings, reviews, tutorials, and much much more, please do remember to subscribe. Again, thank you so much for watching, and as always, I'll catch you all in the next video. Peace.